friends, welcome back to my channel. It's Megan and today I'm going to be doing a fairy loot unboxing. The reason I'm not doing this as part of my regular Mythical Mail Monday series is because fairy loot accidentally sent me two of the exact same box. Something went wrong with my subscription and I got charged twice even though I wasn't supposed to so I did receive two boxes this month and I'm going to be doing a giveaway for one of them. So watch me unbox this one so that you can receive this one. And yes, this will be only open to uh, US residents as I will have to pay for shipping and shipping is very expensive, especially for a full box of things. So you do have to be a US resident, 18 plus or have parents permission to show your address so on so forth and i will link all of the contest rules down below essentially just show indication that you are subscribed to me by sending me a picture uh follow my twitter my instagram and my tiktok and that's pretty much it so let's go ahead and unbox so you know what you're getting so here is the box it is what the future holds it's a dystopian sci-fi theme the first thing i am pulling out is ooh, a pillowcase so it looks like we got a i think this is red rising by pierce brown pillowcase and it is character art and it says through friendship no through hardship to the stars and then the back side says per aspera at astra red rising pierce brown yes and this is just a fabric pillowcase. Next is our uh, tarot cards coming back in stock. And this is five of wands and six of wands. And I think these might be from Spin the Dawn. I think these are Spin the Dawn characters. Next, we got a little, how many ounces is this? I want to say like four ounce candle. And it is inspired by the Lunar Chronicles, specifically Ico. It smells of cranberry peach citrus vanilla Ooh, that's like a almost a dream sickle kind of smell next we got a little if i can get all these things out a plastic kind of kit here and in it is a bag um last time we got one of these it was silverware so i hope it's that again because i really like that little kit Well, based on the first thing being a knife, I am going to say that this is definitely a silverware set. It looks like this is a spoon and a fork. And the quote is, everything science fiction until someone makes it science fact. I'm not sure what that's from. Also does not tell me, uh, but there is character art on the plastic case. According to the spoiler card, it is inspired off of Warcross. Next, we got whatever this is. It's just a little box here it says oh little moon fairy lights so it is exactly what it says it is little crescent moon fairy lights next we got an enamel pin it's a vicious inspired enamel pin plenty of humans were monstrous plenty of monsters knew how to play at being human and of course the final thing in here is our book of the month so this month we received this Golden Flame by Emily Victoria. We did receive this in Lit Joy Crate as well, but this is a alternative dust jacket. I really like this one, especially like that gold embossing that stands out and then you flip it this way and it's more of the title, but this way it's more gold and this way more title. Yeah, on the back it says change your fate, pay the price, and it's got red sprayed edges. It is also signed by Emily Victoria. It has an under the cover hardcover embossing and dust jacket. So very pretty. I'm still not sure what this is about. So let's read the synopsis together, shall we? Um, orphaned and forced to serve her country's ruling group of scribes, Karis wants nothing more than to find her brother long ago shipped away. But family bonds don't matter to the scriptorium, whose sole focus is unlocking the magic of an ancient automaton army. In her search for her brother, Karis does the seemingly impossible. She awakens a hidden automaton. Intelligent with a conscience of his own, Alex has no idea idea why he was made or why his father their nation's greatest traitor once tried to destroy the automatons suddenly the scriptorium isn't just trying to control karis it's hunting her together with alex karis must find her brother and the secret that's held her country in its power for centuries 
I also believe that there is a like seafaring pirate-esque vibe to this as well because the Lit Joy crate under the cover dust jacket has them on a pirate ship. So I don't know. Finally, we have our art card and author letter as well as the spoiler card bookmark. And last but not least, our little fairy scoop magazine. And next month's theme is going to be Frozen Fables. In this box, you can expect items inspired by The Bear and the Nightingale, Winter Song, Spinning Silver, Wicked Saints, Winterwood, and even The Darkest Stars. There's also going to be a ceramic mug featuring artwork by the brilliant Mono Lime Art. And the featured book will include an exclusive cover, shimmery sprayed edges, artwork on the reverse of the dust jacket, foil embossing on the case, and we'll have custom in papers signed by the author. Pretty exciting book next month, and yes! As I said, subscribe to my channel, follow Twitter, follow Instagram, follow TikTok, and then comment down below with your handles and favorite dystopian and or sci-fi book. And that will be your entrance into the competition. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Enter the giveaway down below and I'll check in with you later. Bye friends.